Let's take a look at how to sculpt and shape objects using the Modify panel. The Modify panel lets you change parameters related to a selected object. It also provides access to modifiers, which are tools that deform objects in various ways. Here, we'll use modifiers to sculpt one side of the character's head, and then mirror it on the other side. To pick a modifier, make a selection from the alphabetized list. You can also jump through the list by pressing the first letter of the modifier name. After you apply a modifier, it is inserted above the current entry in the modifier stack. The Edit Poly modifier lets you sculpt the object by editing its sub-object geometry. An object's geometry is mainly defined by points in space, also called vertices. To round out one side of the head, first access the vertex sub-object level, and then select and move the desired vertices. To turn a modifier's effect on or off in the stack, click its light bulb icon. You can also use modifiers to work more efficiently. By adding a symmetry modifier, any changes you make to one side are mirrored on the other. When multiple modifiers are applied to the object, the modifier stack evaluates them from bottom to top. Swapping modifiers alters the stack order, which can impact the final result. Additional modeling tools are available in the Modify panel, as well as in the Graphite modeling tools. Using these tools, you can sculpt your object iteratively. In the next movie, we'll explore the material editor.